see if we can figure this out. Let's go to the wiki. And go to... Let's see. Where would it be under? I'm on US East, I think. On... Start with S. Sarissi? I think this is where I'm at. This is the world I'm on right now. So I think these are like servers. Progression. Skills. Lore. Guilds. Players can combine beacons with other players to form settlements. Okay. That's good to know. Um, let me spin these first. There we go. I think it crashed. Please tell me I don't have to log in every time. Please don't tell me I have to log in every time. There we go. I don't have to log in. Good. Good. What happened at night time? It was so night. Take me to another place. So, to be claimed, a plot initially requires a beacon control. Which I have one. I have a beacon control here. Uh, fuel permissions color change beacon color add gleam to change your beacon color beacon color what the heck is gleam doesn't matter um friends list how do I friends list let's get some people on my friends list let's see tab no escape no Hell no. They asked me to import it from the beginning and I said no. I should, probably should have. Hmm. Probably need to log into Steam, don't I? Let me understand your plan. Once the area is claimed, the control block is no longer necessary. I don't know how that works. Dude, this... <laughs> I don't know what piece of grass is covering up my face. I think it's the grass down here. Let's, let's, let's see if I can... Let's shovel that. Yeah, let's, let's, let's do some... Oh, crap. Let's do some... Um... Because every time I go to this screen, it's like this giant blade of grass in my face. Crap. That gonna... No! I broke it, chat. I don't, I don't deserve to live here. Barbed grass seed. Okay. So this is barbed grass. So apparently this protected zone is protected against world regeneration. So if you chop down a tree, it won't grow back. Etc. Etc. But this block here is going to degrade because I placed that outside of my, my claim zone here. 
Okay, so if I go to this now... <laughs> That's even worse! What is this camera angle? Why do you keep doing that? Alright, I still don't understand this, though. This... Um... This whole plots thing is, just doesn't make sense to me. I haven't gone through the loop of using it. Dude, you just get rewards just to get more rewards, to get more rewards, to get more rewards, to get more rewards. I've got all this coin. Anybody know what that does? So I remember I went to this and it was like I could deposit coin. I learned that. Coin box. So I guess this is how people can pay tax for being in your stuff. Contract. Can expand. Okay. Enough of that. Let's continue to build our starter home. Yes. Our starter home. Where we will call home. And I'm going to have to find some meat or some food. Like, I'm kind of surprised. This biome generation looks kind of weird. Uh, I'm kind of surprised there's no, like, vegetables or veggie stuff to eat. Seems to be only meat so far. We'll see if that changes. Okay, I have a hammer and I have that here. Let's go ahead and do this. Axe. Let me axe you something. So we're just going to build a whole bunch of, I'll chop down a bunch of trees to get this house built. So I can have a basic domicile. That will expand upon, up, 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 no, obviously, but, um, yeah, the plot thing is a mystery right now. I mean, based on what you guys have been saying from the wiki, it seems like a collaboration thing. And I'm kind of glad I didn't go all out and buy like super plots or anything. Like a big, big bowl of plots. And we definitely need all this foliage. Each plot needs a beacon. All right. So. The amount of beacons I'm able to to place is limited by my plots. So that beacon control consume the plot. Is that a good assumption? So if I go and place another, we can try that. I can go place another plot. But see, I don't even know where to see how many plots I have. Like there's, I couldn't find it in the UI like this to show me my plots. I was looking. It has an icon. Um, but I don't see anything that tells me how many plots I have. Anyway. That'd be nice to know. Because I had two from the beginning, and I think they got consumed. And then I bought five more with cubits that I earned. You saw two out of seven land plots. Where? Here. There it is. Okay. So... Science. Let's go place another beacon. Um, not the campfire, but the other beacon. And see if that consumes a plot. And that will answer my question. Okay, so let's just do it like right next to it. Like somewhere over here. I gotta craft one first. So... Beacon? What is this, though? You know what? This is what I think I need. A beacon plotter. This will expand my existing beacon. To add more plots. Let me see how this works. We're going to change it. We're going to change our mind, chat. Uh, I didn't take it out.
take it out, put it in your hand. That that's just clumsy. Oh, okay. So if I if I put this right here, it's gonna expand it there. <laughs> that work? I don't think it work. I have to hold it down. Okay. So, four out of seven plots use. So, if I go over here... So, it's just... This doesn't consume itself. Five out of seven plots. Six out of seven plots. Okay! Yeah, this is what I want. This is what I want right here. Seven out of seven plots. I'm officially out of plots. Excellent. Okay. So you don't have to craft. This doesn't... Okay. I thought it was going to consume that. So now... I think... Why is that dark purple? Hmm. Hmm. There is insufficient prestige on this beacon and his neighbors to form a settlement. 10,000 is required. Okay. Strangers may warp into this beacon. No, we're not going to turn that on. Okay. So I think I got a better handle on beacons. I think. Combination of those two things. Campfire is a temporary beacon. The other thing is more of a permanent beacon. You can use a beacon control thing to add and remove beacons. And there's another beacon item. Fuel, which gives uh, fuel to the thing. Oh, I can't even craft the other thing anymore. Oh. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. All right, let's get some wood here so we can uh, start placing some blocks. Take me to another place. Take me to another land. Let me understand your plan. That's the wrong block, chat. You did this. Should be right. It's a different color! But twisted wood timber is... Light tan. Why does it look like ancient? I don't know what's happening. Uh, okay. We're, we're just going to assume that didn't happen. That's what we're going to do. We're just going to... We're going to make a door. See how the door looks. Um, Plain wooden door. Crap. I'm not a fan of this. Q goes in the table. Pull out of the table. Contents. Put in your inventory. Take it out of your inventory. Put it in your hand. That whole workflow seems to take for a while. Lotus Pocus, thank you so much for extending your sub, chat, or guy, dude. Thank you so much for the love. Appreciate it. I think I got some on the soundboard for you. Hold on. We're going to throw you a yee. yee. There we go. We got a yee and we got a... Shazbot. Thank you so much for the support. We got a laugh. Wait, what's this? <laughs> it's a laugh track. I forgot I even had that. Neat. Neat. Okay, so we got the door. Nine seconds. Oh, I need to reduce the reduce the price of ye, don't I? <laughs> Nobody's rich enough for ye. Resub the one to get laughed at. Hey, man, I didn't make these rules. I only made the ground that they were built upon. All right, I'm scared. Are you kidding me? What am I, a hobbit? Oh, Mr. Frodo, would you like me to go out and pick some flowers? What is this? I'm a hobbit, chat. It's a decorative prop. It doesn't even work. Maybe it does work. <laughs> Who stole all my points? We had, a, we had a point reset about a month ago. Something like that. Uh, 
Ah, oh, it takes a whole minute to craft this hobbit door. Yeah, that was a problem. I gave away like 50 gajillion points to people when Champ gave away gave me 200 subs. And uh, there's a 32-bit integer limit, so you can't do that. It breaks the bot, so I had to I had to, I had to reset the points because I broke it. There we go. It's done. It's in the contents. We now have a second. See, so I have to take it out here, put it in here, put it in my hand. Can I put this on top of this? Are you joking? How do I? Huh? Is it like a gate? It actually swings. Oh my goodness. The doors are jank. I gotta see what this does. Thank you! Okay. Alright, so if I... Okay. It, it, it's smart enough. Well, it, it swings the wrong way, but... Wait! That auto close? It didn't. Okay, I thought it did. All right, I, I'll, I'll accept that. That was a lot harder than it should have been. I agree. Um, but we're this is a song of learning. We're learning, chat. We are a song of learning, and this stupid block insulted me. Um, that one. <laughs> We got this. We got this chat. Okay. Man, this is slow. I think there's a building skill attribute, if I'm not mistaken. Where are skills? I forgot how to get the character. Skills. Tab? Yeah. I think there's a build. There's crafting. Tool crafting, tech crafting. Um, there's nothing about building though. Oh wait, you can okay, you can you can boost your attributes here. I didn't know that. Oh, I just like just gloss right over this. I can give myself more strength, more power, more luck. Okay. Uh, grapple mastery, spanner mastery. There's nothing about building though. The building is just slow. Food crafting. All right, so shovel mastery. In that one. That guy. 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 <laughs> All right. Apply. Last time I tried to do that, it crashed, so it didn't apply it. Your dudes have been working out. <laughs> this is how they come by default, man. This is how they come by default. Um, dude, I don't. Until I get a spanner to craft blocks, it's gonna be the blockiest building since the inception of Minecraft block inception. Oh, and that's so slow. The good news is that once night hits, check out the sky. You can start. You can see the plan is kind of in the daytime, but once. The skybox just gets really pretty. It's like they just they just went all out with that. Um But so far so good. I mean I'm 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 learning. We figured out the beacons and the plot system. It's kinda weird. So I think I'm only gonna Whoa, that that I thought I turned off Bloom. That's some JJ Abrams right there. Um, I'm not going to make this too big of a house. I'm 
make it one more. Actually, this is probably bigger than I wanted it to be. I don't know how I'm going to get back up here. Like, there's no ladders. I guess I have to make a dirt ladder. I'm going to have to make a dirt ladder. Do monsters come out at night? I'm in a, I'm in a, uh, essentially a friendly zone. So, if I would have went to a hostile zone in the beginning, because they gave you the option to go to a hostile zone or friendly, maybe they would have been a, oh, that. Maybe there would have been, um, something, but no, nah, there's nothing. All right. Well, we got our door and we got a basic derp bill here. Okay. Um, so I got to eat soon. You can see my stamina bar at the bottom is slowly going down. I guess I don't have any more bones because that last... The last kangaroo sheep I killed didn't have any bones drop. So I need bones to make more glue. And glue is required to make other things. Because I want to make the advanced table. You can make a... I have a basic workbench, but there's an advanced workbench. This guy right here. Um, and I need any base metal. I have... I thought I had copper. I think it's in the furnace. Yeah, it's in the front. So I have I have copper here. Um any tech remnant. I don't know where to find that. I, I guess I have to find that out in the world. And then I can make a workbench and maybe craft more advanced stuff. Then there's storage items here. Um where I can probably make a storage thing, which I said I was gonna do. So can I make wood? I'm out of wood. All right, so take what the world was that? Take a look at the skybox. Oh, it actually has clouds now. It was clear before. You can see the other planets. I'm pretty sure you can go to those. It's hailing again. What is this? I guess it is hail. I called it popcorn before. Could be ash. Okay, that's not the right button. Oh, I got strawberries out of this. Hold on. Wait a minute. I just saw that. Why a tick? I've got a bunch of strawberries here. Hold on. Nom, 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 nom. I didn't know that foliage gave you strawberries. Okay, there's my food problem. Oh, we're full. That's cool. That's actually kind of good. So maybe if you put points into that luck attribute, uh, you have been hit with a positive status effect. The enemies are, the effects are temporary and will expire when the timer runs out. I don't know what the full thing gives you. They're strawberries. On this planet, strawberries look like cherries. It's called the Pac-Man planet. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, Pac-Man planet. Is this what planet surrounded by other planets? It seems to be. It's like, I don't know what kind of... The weirdness is going on, but... Apparently... They're not running into each... I, I don't... I'm out on the moon? I mean, because I'm really close. It seems to be moving. Now, think if you hit. Oh, yeah, those are plant. Yeah, those are plate. Those are players. If I had a teleportation thing, I could like zoom in on one of those things and then just like zip to it. Alder, Placid Lush World, Marks, Placid Lush World, Petula, Rugged Lush World. Okay, that's just nothing. And we got yeah marks. And then what's this over here? Lambalus. Chicopolis. Inhospitable lush world. And beckon. Yeah, those are all the players. Where they've landed and settled. 
That's what they told me in the tutorial in the beginning. I mean, once I get settled, I can go exploring and start bothering people. <laughs> Rocket PC Gaming, thanks for the other host, man. Appreciate it. What is this? Rosetta Knox. I still don't know what that is. Ooh. Basic gathering feat. Cataloging. Coin and XP. I still don't know what coin is for. Yet. I know what cubits are for, but I don't know what coins are for. I can get more plots. Uh, additional character costs 600 cubits. I didn't see this. Cleanse points. Skill set reset. Skill set. Appearance change. And a tent kit. I hear birds at night. How hard is it to get off planet? Um, we can science it. Warp conduit. There it is. Um, any rock, any trunk. Okay, let's get some trunks. Sorry. All right, there's two trunks. If I understand, in the beginning, you combine this warp conduit. I think this is the same thing. You combine that with your your totem. No, that's not how it works. There was something you combined with your totem before the warp. So warp conduit isn't what I think it is. An intricate block which can be stacked with others to create a warp. So you gotta make more than one. I guess. Let's science it, chat. And I'm hitting this with the wrong thing. We'll create like four, I guess. That sounds like a good even number. Alright, I hear birds. And I hear the freaking... Kangaroo sheep. All right, I got four. Uh, okay, so Might have to. All right. So I, there was something I put in my totem to warp that they gave me in the beginning. I thought it was this, but it's not. To get to another planet, you'll need to make a warp location picker upgrade. It's in the ammo from the totem that lets you target another planet. Save location on that planet. A warp location picker. All right, we'll take care of that. Yeah, that's. I guess that's the item I was I was talking about or looking for. It's like a little. It looks like a gem that you slot inside of your totem, and then you can just point at the planet and zip off you go. And don't ask me how to get home. So, you might go out there and you might have to craft another one to get home. It's a good question, though. Alright. Where's my home? There we go. And Rosetta's not it's a beautiful low growing plant that bears resemblance to rest that bears useful recipe resources. A mineral heavy rock that teaches language. 